This is Opera Mobile 11.5. First time anyone in public sees Opera Mobile 11.5. I want to point out a feature which has been part of Opera Mobile for a while. It's speed dials. You use speed dial as the main starting concept because speed dials and captures the notion that all web pages are applications and we show them and make it easy for people to think about it. Okay, let's download one, uh, uh, one application, one web page. I'm taking down BBC News. Okay, you saw my finger on, on the one of them and you'll see it downloading at the same pace on both of them. Uh, and, um, uh, and I can scroll. Well, that was a good. Uh, you never see checkerboard on, 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 on this browser again. It's, it's really, really smooth when you scroll up and down. You know, it reveals the, the incre incredibly efficient in terms of the browser, what goes up on under the hood in order to, to make sure that the experience is as pleasurable as possible. <coughs> I'm going to show you one cool thing that we added in 11.5. Uh, I'm going to click the, the menu button, click on help, I'm going to click something called data usage. Go to data usage. It says original size 746 kilobytes, received size 746 kilobytes, 0% data settings. Ah. So but it also says Opera Turbo is currently disabled. To save data, please enable it. I'm going to enable it. I'll click Opera Turbo, and then Opera Turbo is, is enabled. If I now go to um, um, uh, a page here, you know, the top page of BBC, this is live, of course, we're downloading pages as we speak. Uh, you'll, you'll, you'll get uh, content transmitted to the device, uh, but compressed in our servers. Now, over the years, Opera has developed a global server-side infrastructure with thousands upon thousands of CPU cores, which can be used in order to offload processing on the device. Now, this is in place. We had it function for several years, and now we're, I'm showing you how we use it on, 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 on tablets. So I, I download this page here. I can scroll down to it. Oh, no checkerboard. Oh, you'll never see checkerboard on this one. Um, and I can go to the, to the menu again. I'll press help. I'll press data usage. And you see 61% data savings. Original size 180 kilobytes, received size 71 kilobytes. Opera Turbo is currently enabled. You can look at the total, because the previous page was so big, and I only put the savings on for the current page, the total savings is, is, is rather small. But if I let it on, if I had it on for a month, I mean, there would be literally gigabytes of savings. This might not be so important when I'm at home, you know, sharing my wireless network with myself, but it certainly is important when you're in a hotel and you want to access a, a communal resource, or, if you are, as most people today, uh, with a tablet or a mobile device which has a SIM card in it, and God forbid, if you're traveling abroad and you don't have a, a cheap roaming plan. I think this is a really, really cool feature. Of course, Opera Mini runs here as well. Of course, I can download on Opera Mini the same page. Of course, when the page arrives, it will look virtually uh, equal. Uh, and it's you know really <coughs> nice and use to use, and, and of course I can go into the to the section here and I can click data usage and I can see the savings here. Now up here you have 82% savings. In the previous demo you had 61% savings. What's the difference? Now Opera Mobile is a product working on mobile phones and tablets where you are doing the heavy lifting on the device. You are, you are doing JavaScript, you know, run, you have JavaScript runtime on the device, you are CSS processing on the device, you do the parsing of the HTML on the device. The data savings is for, for compressing the data and sending it over, so you can save time and save costs. Opera Mini uh, is, is, is a product where we do the heavy lifting on the server. All the heavy lifting is on the server. There we do the JavaScript, we do the HTML, and we do the CSS. And what we send over to the device is a very simple setup in proprietary language, uh, and we just, uh, which is very, very simple to render. That is why we achieve more data settings on Opera Mini. 
And of course, in Opera Mini, you cannot turn off the data sets. Also, in Opera Mobile, you can. Uh, I'm going to take away the tablet, move it away, and going to put on 